Hello and welcome to Baxi's Training Tuesday Tip here at Warrington Training Centre. I'm Richard Green and here's today's tip. In this Training Tuesday, we're going to talk all about how you would test the misters. Ideally, to check if the mister, you'd have the manufacturer's instructions and find the table which details temperatures to resistance values. You would measure the temperature and then measure the resistance to see if the two marry up. Measure the temperature as close as possible to the thermistor. The temperature is between 10 to 15 degrees, so the resistance value should be somewhere between 15,000 ohms to 20,000 ohms. We're going to measure that on the resistor. With a multimeter set to the ohm scale, place the leads, probes across the thermistor and measure the resistance. And what we've got is 16,600 ohms, which is within that scale, right in the middle of it. That proves the thermistor is good. That is the best way of testing the thermistor. But if you don't have that information to arm the table with resistances and temperatures, etc., here's a generic way you can test the thermistor. A thermistor is a variable resistor. So if we measure across it, there should actually be a measurable resistance. If I'm going between two pins, and what I'm getting is OL, open line, through the actual component, it needs replacing. There should be a measurable resistance shown on your multimeter. Now, what we need to do is change its temperature and see if the resistance value changes. Be careful. Make sure when you do this next point that the boiler is cold. With the boiler cold, all you need to do is change the temperature slightly. Put your hands onto the pipe work as close as you can to the thermistor and you will see that the temperature changes. Does it go down or does it go up? As long as it's changing, the direction doesn't matter. That shows it's responding to temperature change. 